What is considered a normal adult resting heart rate? Your options are 50 to 60 beats per minute, 60 to 100 beats per minute, 100 to 120 beats per minute, or 120 beats to 140 beats per minute. The correct answer is B, that is 60 to 100 beats per minute. A normal adult resting heart rate typically ranges from 60 to 100 beats per minute. The rates outside this range could indicate health issues. Let's move on to the question number two. That is, which of the following is the normal range for systolic blood pressure in an adult? Your options are 80 to 100 mmHg, 100, 100 to 120 mmHg, 120 to 140 mmHg, or 140 to 160 mmHg. The correct answer is C, that is 120 to 140 mmHg. The normal systolic blood pressure for adults is typically between 120 to 140 mmHg. Higher values may suggest hypertension. Now, let's face question number 3. That is, what does the diastolic blood pressure measure? Your options are pressure during heart contraction, pressure during heart relaxation, heart rate or body temperature. The correct answer is B that is pressure during heart relaxation. The diastolic blood pressure measures the pressure in the arteries when the heart is at rest between beats. It is the lower number in a blood pressure reading. And now question number 4 for you. Which vital sign is measured using thermometer? Your options are blood pressure, heart rate, body temperature or respiratory rate. The correct answer is C that is body temperature. Body temperature is measured with a thermometer and it indicates if a person has fever or is hypothermic. Now let's move on to the question number 5. What is the normal respiratory range for an adult at rest? Your options are 10 to 20 breaths per minute, 20 to 30 breaths per minute, 30 to 40 breaths per minute or 40 to 50 breaths per minute. The correct answer is A that is 10 to 20 breaths per minute. An adult's normal respiratory rate ranges from 10 to 20 breaths per minute. Rates outside this range may indicate respiratory problems. Question number 6 for you. What is the term for a high body temperature? Your options are hypothermia, hyperthermia, hypoglycemia or hypertension. The correct answer is B that is hyperthermia. Hypothermia refers to an elevated body temperature often caused by illness or excessive heat exposure. Question number 7. How is blood pressure typically measured? Your options are pulse oximeter, sigmomanometer, thermometer or stethoscope the correct answer is b that is sigmomanometer 
The blood pressure is measured with seismometer, often used in conjunction with a stethoscope to listen for arterial sound. Question number eight: What is the term for a low heart rate? Your options are tachycardia, bradycardia, arrhythmia, or dyspnea. The correct answer is B. That is bradycardia. Bradycardia refers to a slower than normal heart rate, typically less than sixty beats per minute. Question number nine: What does the term pulse oximetry refer to? Your options are measuring body temperature, measuring blood oxygen levels. Measuring blood pressure or measuring respiratory rate. The correct answer is B. That is measuring blood oxygen levels. The pulse oximeter is used to measure the amount of oxygen in the blood. It is often done with a clip-on device for the finger. Question number ten. What is the normal range for adult body temperature in degrees Celsius? Your options are thirty-five to thirty-six point five degrees Celsius, thirty-six point five to thirty-seven point five degrees Celsius, thirty-seven point five to thirty-eight point five degrees Celsius, or thirty-eight point five. To thirty-nine point five degree Celsius. The correct answer is B. That is thirty-six point five to thirty-seven point five degree Celsius. The normal body temperature for adults is typically between thirty-six point five and thirty-seven point five degree Celsius. Temperatures outside this range may indicate a fever or hypothermia. Question number eleven. What does tachycardia refer to? Your options are slow heart rate, fast heart rate, normal heart rate, or irregular heart rate. The correct answer is B. That is fast heart rate. The tachycardia is a term used to describe a faster than normal heart rate. Usually about a hundred beats per minute. Question number twelve: What vital sign is typically assessed using an ECG, electrocardiogram? Your options are blood pressure, heart rate and rhythm, respiratory rate, or body temperature. The correct answer is B. That is heart rate and rhythm. An ECG measures the electrical activity of the heart, providing information about heart rate and rhythm. Question number thirteen. What is the normal range for diastolic blood pressure in an adult? Your options are. Sixty to eighty mm Hg, eighty to hundred mm Hg, hundred to one hundred and twenty mm Hg, or one hundred and twenty to one hundred and forty mm Hg. The correct answer is A. That is sixty to eighty mm Hg. The normal range for diastolic blood pressure in adults is typically between sixty and eighty mm Hg. Values. Outside this range may indicate hypertension or other issues. Hello, friends. Welcome back to Dear Competitive Exam YouTube channel. Today you are attending hundred most repeated and most important question answer session based on human vital signs, and this is the part one of this series. That everyone must know who are in the medical and nursing field. So do watch this video completely to make yourself more fit.
So let's see what is the quality of your preparation. And end of the video, do not forget to comment your score. Let's continue. Question number 14. What is the term for a low blood pressure reading? Your options are hypertension, hypotension, hyperglycemia, tachycardia. The correct answer is hypotension. Hypotension refers to a lower than normal blood pressure, which can lead to dizziness and fainting. Question number 15. What should be the first action if a patient shows symptoms of hypothermia? Your options are increase the ambient temperature, give hot fluids, apply ice packs or use cold compresses. The correct answer is A that is increase the ambient temperature. For hypothermia, it is crucial to warm the patient gradually by increasing the ambient temperature and using warm blankets. Question number 16. What is the common symptom of fever? Your options are chills, excessive sweating, dry skin or low heart rate. The correct answer is A that is chills. Fever often causes chills as the body tries to increase its temperature to fight off infection. Question number 17. What does a pulse oximeter measure? Your options are heart rate, blood pressure, blood oxygen saturation or body temperature. The correct answer is C that is blood oxygen saturation. A pulse oximeter measures the percentage of oxygen in the blood, which helps assess respiratory efficiency. Question number 18. What is the term for a rapid shallow breathing pattern? Your options are bradypnea, tachypnea, apnea, dyspnea. The correct answer is B that is tachypnea. Tachypnea refers to rapid shallow breathing. It can be a sign of respiratory distress or other conditions. Question number 19. What is the normal body temperature range in degrees Fahrenheit? Your options are 95 to 98 degree Fahrenheit, 98 to 99 degree Fahrenheit, 99 to 100 degree Fahrenheit or 100 to 101 degree Fahrenheit. The correct answer is 98 to 99 degree Fahrenheit. A normal body temperature for adults is between 98 to 99 degrees Fahrenheit. This range indicates a healthy temperature. Question number 20. What is the best time to measure blood pressure for consistency? Your options are before meals, after exercise, at the same time each day or immediately upon walking. The correct answer is C that is at the same time each day. Measuring blood pressure at the same time each day ensure consistency and more accurate readings. Question number 21. Which artery is commonly used to measure blood pressure? Your options are radial, femoral, brachial or carotid. The correct answer is C that is brachial. The brachial artery located in the upper arm is commonly used for blood pressure measurement. Question number 22. What does bradypnea refer to? Your options are rapid breathing, slow breathing, irregular breathing or no breathing. The correct answer is B that is slow breathing. Bradypnea is characterized by slower than normal breathing rates and can indicate various health issues. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी थ्री हाउ इज पल्स रेट टिपिकली मेजर्ड जो ऑप्शन सा बाय काउंटिंग बीट्स एट द रिस्ट बाय यूजिंग अ स्टेथिस्कोप ऑन द चेस्ट बाय यूजिंग अ थर्मोमीटर और बाय मेजरिंग रेस्पिरेटरी रेट The correct answer is A that is by counting beats at the wrist. The pulse rate is commonly measured by palpating the wrist and counting the beats for a set period, usually 30 seconds. Question number 24. What is considered a normal range for an adult's respiratory rate? Your options are 12 to 20 breaths per minute. 20 to 30 breaths per minute 30 to 40 breaths per minute or 40 to 50 breaths per minute the correct answer is a that is 12 to 20 breaths per minute the normal respiratory rate for adults ranges from 12 to 20 breaths per minute this rate is crucial for assessing respiratory health question number 25 What condition can a high body temperature indicate? Your options are hypoglycemia, infection, hypotension or bradycardia. The correct answer is B that is infection. A high body temperature or fever is often a sign of infection as the body responds to pathogens. friends it is a time to comment your score out of 25 questions and friends thanks for joining us on this exciting journey if you enjoyed the quiz and learned something new then give us a thumbs up and let us know in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on our upcoming exploration of fascinating topics in the medical field until the next time stay curious stay healthy see you take care